Hey, Claudia. Mm -hmm. I feel like every day oh. I work with you, I am lucky. Really? Yeah. Are you buttering me up for something? Maybe. <laughs> Want me to buy you some lotto tickets? <laughs> a snack. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> you know, we talk about the Kentucky Lottery a lot just because I feel like every month or so they have a new game, a new way to win right that's uh, come out and that's what we want to chat about today there's so many countless ways to play but also ways to give back to the commonwealth the through thing, scholarships yeah. that is so key joining us to share all the details is chip polson hey there chip hey claudia hey eric good to talk to you all this morning you too hey great to talk to you you know eric and i were just talking about i i do i feel like every month or so there's like a new way to win and i understand you guys have a new game that's just launched We've actually got six new games that are out on the street right now. How about that? Six new scratch off games that are out right now. We've got a $1 and a $3 ticket. We've got three tickets at the $5 price point. Our new Fab Four ticket where you can win up to $48,000. Our money multiplier bonus where you can win up to $60,000. And our new 24 karat gold ticket. That one comes in four different colors and you can win up to 75 grand on that. But Eric and Claudia, the big news is we have a new $10 ticket that's out there bluegrass blowout can win up to 200 grand on that one and that's one of the two-sided tickets the players really enjoy so you scratch off the front play the game there flip it over on the back there's an entirely different game on the back that you can play there so lots of great stuff out there and lots of great ways to win now I'm going to ask a question that technically I should be embarrassed to ask, Chip, but uh, <laughs> okay. I am new to trying to play some of these lottery games, and I bought a ticket uh, a couple of weeks ago, and I scratched off this and scratched off that, and then I didn't know what to do. I didn't know if I'd won, I didn't know if I didn't win, and I didn't want to walk back in and ask, hey, is this a winning ticket, because then I'd be embarrassed. So, I mean, is there any kind of support for people like me who are kind support. of new to some of these? Yes, these we, we have that, a support group for people like you, Eric. I need That's to right. We all come won. together. <laughs> We all hold hands and it, it, it's a beautiful moment. It really is. But no, you got, you got two different things you can do there. You can go online at our website at kylottery.com, pull up the ticket, and we'll give you how to play instructions there. Or the easiest way to find out in the bottom right corner of that ticket, there's a barcode. Scratch off that barcode and there are ticket scanners at retail. You can scan that ticket and when you scan the ticket, it'll tell you if you're a winner and how much you've won. Game changer. Perfect. I'm glad you asked it. because See, I, I needed to know. I, I needed to know. <laughs> because I buy the games like based on like how flashy of a name and then I'm like, did I win? Yeah. Well, and then I'll go and do chip. That's exactly what you said. I'll go and like scan it and I'm like, yay, okay. Yep. That's I, how it works. I, we, I love we it. have a lot of Right, we have a lot of folks who really, they won't even scratch off the entire game. They know that little trick with the barcode, so they'll just scratch oh. off the barcode, pop it under that scanner and see. I enjoy being able to play a game yeah. through and kind yeah. of see what it plays like. But scan that barcode and you'll know immediately how, how you've done. Now see, my know. best questions now are the know. ones that start with, I should be embarrassed <laughs> to ask know. this, however I'm not. <laughs> All right, Chip, uh, one of the, the great things about the Kentucky Lottery is where the sales go. Tell us a little bit more about that. That's right, as we always like to talk about Lottery proceeds in Kentucky fund college scholarship and grant programs, including every dime of the popular key scholarship ever awarded. More than $4 billion, with a B, $4 billion have gone to those programs. And one in five Kentuckians has now received a college scholarship or grant paid for by lottery proceeds. And as you can imagine, that's something we're awfully proud of. And Chip, for those wanting to get their hands on some of these scholarships and grant funds, there's an important date coming up, right? Eric, you're exactly right. So the beauty of that keys program is that you don't have to apply for those dollars. Those funds will automatically follow you to a Kentucky school or university based on your grades in high school and your ACT scores. But Eric, what a lot of folks don't realize is that more than half of our proceeds, which is in excess of $100 million, go to need-based programs, go to students based on financial aid, need. And you have to apply for those. And the window for applying for these programs opens on October 1st. So in just about two weeks, you're going to be able to apply for those funds for the next school year, and those are first come, first served. The way that you do that is that you have to fill out the free application for federal student aid or the FAFSA to be eligible. The great folks at the Kentucky Higher Education Assistance Authority, or KIA, are the ones who administer those programs. Go to KHEAA.com. They'll walk you through how to fill out that form and be eligible for, again, in excess of $100 million just next year that we'll have available for need-based programs. All right, Chip, finally, before we go, we have a very important question for you. Is What's it that? true that you have the world's greatest miniature train set in your basement? 
<laughs> at the holidays, I've been known to have a big giant Christmas village down there with a train that runs through it. And as a matter of fact, last year, we actually did something uh, here on the show with it. So maybe this December, when I roll out the new version, we can take a look at that one as well. Yes, yeah, we're absolutely. Showing, we're there. I, I know you can't see it, Chip, but because you're all <laughs> oh, of this, but we're is. showing. Yeah, I can see yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. 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 That's so funny. Yeah, that's it from last year. So started uh, picking up pieces for that probably 20 years ago, which is hard to believe. But the train runs through it there and everything. You can see the train is so big now, it almost laps itself. It almost catches itself <laughs> from the front to back. And, and we get the smoke that comes out there and everything. But it's a lot of fun. Started doing it for my kids when they were little. And now it's kind of become a family and neighborhood tradition. A lot of folks like to come over and check it out. We always have a good time with it. It's so impressive. I, I love when people have fascinating hobbies yes. like that. And, and it, it just makes me want to try to come up with one myself, but that is. Chip, can we get video of the new one when it goes up? Absolutely. You got cool. the exclusive right here. Yes. We'll do that. All right, Chip, thank you so much. You can find <laughs> Good to more talk to you as always. You can find more about the Kentucky Lottery, games they offer, and where your money goes at kylottery.com.